Cyber security graduates are in high demand, one of the fastest growing fields globally and making PR applications smoother, critical need worldwide. Australia is a perfect destination for you if you are looking or thinking of going. Hi guys, hello and welcome back to another video. This is your caps log and today we are back with another video with a great topic which everyone is asking for in the comment section and they want to me to create a video on this topic as soon as possible. So today I'm giving you this topic which is called cyber security. Yes, cyber security. If you are thinking of studying cyber security in Australia, this is the exact video or the brief video which you will be needing in the initial step to maybe understand what this subject is going to be, what the future purpose of this subject when you will study this is going to be and what you can gain and achieve while doing this course and after like settling in in Australia, the ways of how you will do it. So let's dive into and start, you know, reading all the stuff which I always write first and uh, giving you information on that. And also before starting, if you want me to talk on any other particular topic or the course that you want me to explain, as I have a whole playlist of explaining different courses, you can check through the playlist. Maybe I've already explained your course. And if you want me to explain particular course that you want, make sure to write them in the comment section or join the Telegram group and DM me directly, maybe there on on Instagram. So cyber security, yes, as I mentioned, one of the fastest growing fields globally from course details to PR perspectives, job opportunities and beyond. I'll cover everything in this video briefly and sometimes elaboratively depending on the particular content I'm speaking on. So first is why should you study cyber security in Australia? Cyber security is rapidly expanding profession in today's digital age and this is why it's a great choice for you to study cyber security in Australia is High demand as with the high rise in the cyber threats, the need for skilled cybersecurity professionals is booming. Industry links in Australian universities collaborated with leading tech companies providing exposure to cutting edge companies with the great practices that they have. Global recognition degrees from Australian institutions are recognized worldwide. Yes, it is true. And immigration opportunities, obviously, cybersecurity professionals are listed on Australian medium and long term strategic skills list, which is often lead to correct ways to get a permanent residency in Australia. While talking on the course structure, cyber security courses in Australia combine theory and hands-on learning experience to prepare students for the industry level growth and the courses will be rather in undergraduate programs or in postgraduate. Undergraduate means bachelor's, right? Which is typically three years covering foundational topics like network security and data protection. And masters in cyber security, which is postgraduate, will be around one to two years, depending on if you'll do it part time or full time, focusing on advanced concepts like ethical hacking and cryptography. And so the core subjects, the core subjects would be cyber security fundamentals, network and cloud security, cyber forensics, ethical hacking, risk management, artificial intelligence, cybersecurity and you will also write engage in real world projects and case studies to gain practical knowledge with the tutors and the other students that will be present in your class well the next part is the top universities offering cybersecurity programs to you guys which would be University of Technology Sydney which is UTS Deakin University RMIT University La Trobe University Griffith University University of Queensland University of New South Wales University of Melbourne Monash University and Edith Cowan University entry requirements for you would be to enroll in cybersecurity programs if you are going for undergraduate you need a completion of e plus two with a focus on subjects like mathematics and IT. If you're going for postgraduate, you obviously need a relevant bachelor's degree in IT, engineering or related field, which will be required by the universities. You can go through their website and read what they want actually. And yes, English proficiency is something that's everywhere required, which is an IELTS or PT score with no less than 6.0. So try to get at least 6.5, but greater would be better for you. Well, cost and scholarships. So let's discuss the cost. Undergraduate programs, which is bachelor's, will be around $30,000 to $45,000 per year. And postgraduate programs will be $35,000 to $50,000. Yeah, make sure to include your living expenses as well. Okay, so the scholarships, yeah. There are scholarships available. Australia's award scholarships, destination award scholarships, and university-specific scholarship. For example, RMIT International Excellence Scholarship, which is only like RMIT specific, but they are different university specific. So you can get into that and read on that too. Employment opportunities. Cybersecurity graduates are in high demand across various sectors, including government, banking, healthcare, and information and technologies. And the job roles would be cybersecurity analyst, security consultant, penetration tester, which is technically ethical hacker, and digital forensic expert. So salaries would be, for if you're going for entry level, the approximate salary would be $75,000 to $120,000 annually. 
Mid level would be 120 to 140,000 dollars and senior level would be obviously more than 150,000 dollars annually depending on experience and specialization. If I'll talk about placement opportunities, internships and work integrated learning. Yes, opportunities to work with companies like IBM, Deloitte and PwC gaining hands-on experience and industry exposure and universities do have you know good tie-ups with their, these tech firms so you can directly link yourself with them. And talking about the PR pathways, cybersecurity professionals are listed in Australia's medium and long-term strategic skills list which I've already mentioned, making it a strong pathway leading to permanent residency in Australia. Eligible visas that you would be applying will be skilled independent visa which is subclass 189, no state sponsorship is required there, skilled nominated visa which is 190, so requires state nomination but offers additional PR points obviously and skilled work regional visa which is 491 requires work or study in regional areas and provides PR pathways and some steps that you can use to boost your PR experience would be improve your English proficiency and gain relevant work experience in Australia and consider studying in regional which may offer additional benefits to permanent residency eligibility and just want to tell you cyber security professionals are highly valued and making PR applications smoother, especially with increasing demand in this field. But there's huge competition as well just to keep you posted. Well, future scope. With the technology evolving rapidly, the future scope of cybersecurity is immense. Specialization advanced into areas like AI-based systems, obviously, quantum cryptography or cloud security. Global opportunities would be cybersecurity is a great critical need worldwide opening doors to international doors as well it's not only you will be staying here you can go depending on which nation you want to go you can go in that too further studies you can also go for further studies uh, like pursuing some certifications like ci ssp cep or postgraduate studies for specialized expertise leadership roles progress into management positions such as chief information security officer ciso with an ever-growing demand for cyber professional there's a field where innovation and career growth go hand in hand so conclusion yes so cyber security is not just a subject it's not just a course it's a field it's a more than a just a career right it's a mission to protect the world from digital crimes or that we call cyber crimes with excellent knowledge excellent education strong job market and pr opportunities australia is a perfect destination for you if you are looking or thinking of going to study cyber security in australia so, so if you're thinking of kickstarting your journey in this particular field, this is the correct time. This is the best, I would say, video or information that I could give you in a 10 minutes video section and covering as many part or the knowledge as I can give you. So if you need more information, I've made podcasts as well in this particular topic. So you can go and watch them when students were speaking on this topic. So maybe you can get some knowledge. And if you want me to speak on some other topics, just do let me know in the comment section. Make sure to join Telegram group if you want to take help or do help for someone. That's a great point. And if you want to stay connected to me or the channel, subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description. If you got any knowledge from this video, make sure to like the video. At least I'll get motivation. And share this to someone who's thinking of going to study cybersecurity in future. So this is Caps Lock signing off. See you in the next video. Bye.